Hi guys, so today we're just gonna go straight into it. I'm making nice sticky barbecue ribs. It's pork ribs, and then I'm gonna have them with mashed potatoes. Um, you can put honey. I'm just gonna show you all the ingredients that I used. Um, and then I'm using these two spices, the barbecue spice, and then the other one is a potato spice, the roast potato spice. It's very nice on meat actually. Um, and roast potatoes, but I normally use it in meat and my curries as well. Okay. Uh, I'll add salt and then just a little bit of oil so that my ribs don't dry out in the oven. So you can make this also on a barbecue or a braai. And it's very nice. Moon, I'm a guest. Or chilling with your friends. Um, on my weekend. Uh, nipuza, and then you can just have these ribs. So I'm putting a spoon of everything. So a spoon of barbecue spice, a spoon of this aromatic uh, potato spice. And then I'm going to add some peri-peri. It's optional. I just add a little bit. And then add a pinch of salt. Because the other sauce, this sauce, has a lot of salt. Um, it has soy sauce. So you know soy sauce has usawa wood. So fire, just maybe let's say a quarter cup. Like six spoons or so. And then just stir it together. Kutlangani, kutlangani, kutlangani. Besu fagoma ribsako. As long as the sauce le it tastes like just taste it. it taste the salt, to good variety, uh, balance like everything is fine. Then your ribs will be nice. Okay, so just pour it over your ribs. I don't have a brush. Give me na guys, ningang chachi. A brush la mila sala le kopitor. But yeah, um, I'm gonna baste my ribs with the sauce yami, um, and then you cook them at 180 degrees C. I'll show you. Um, on grill for like maybe 30 minutes and then literally grill them for 5 to 10 minutes so as we say right so when we overcook it will dry and it will be dry it will be dry it will be dry it will be overcook so I'll show you your stove setting um, but this is how they look before okay so I'm a zambani for your mashed potato so I don't think you would need to know that step. You just boil your potatoes. I boil them with skin on. Okay, you see the stove setting. It's on 180 and then there's the grill, the two bars, right? And then you set up your timer. Just set 30 minutes. It grills and then you add the sauce again. Um, and you grill again. Okay. So you see, I'm mashing my potatoes. I've already cooked them. As I said, I boil them on with skin on so that they don't. Um, I'm mashing in sabili, sir. Then uba snacks my entire. So I did that, and then after that, I'm going to add butter. So put back, put your 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 pot back in the stove. <laughs> um, on, on low heat. Here's the favorite spice, inner parmans for potato spices. It's really nice on mesh, this potato spice, guys. I see that it's really nice when it comes to in mesh. So, I'm going to say that it's so cool. Or on the potato salad, that video, let me turn it cool here. I like to use that spice. Okay, so you will mix your butter. That's about like two spoons of butter, if two tablespoons of butter, if you have or seven spoon, and then make sure you see it will low heat okay, so that it will melt easily. Depending on how you like the consistency, um, um, you could add water here or a little bit of milk if you want to me now i don't want to because i know after heating it up a bit so i like this type of consistency yeah so this is what i like but if you want it even more watery you can just add a little bit of water i just don't know how you guys then eat that but it's fine so this is my mesh it's done and the meal is literally finished it was so nice it's all sad um yeah so you don't even need to but i wanted them to have that color you know so that's why i had that leftover sauce so yeah we are father yeah bon energy was my channel i have at least already and then you just sprinkle them with parsley if you have it just for aesthetics but if you don't have it it's fine
wabuisele kanani aho istofu zobu sikishili. So you switch off your stove, wabuisele kanani for 2 minutes, just so that the sauce um, is sticky gash. Right? And then you see, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Um, and then I'll just plate it sealy. That's all. So as you can see how nice my meal looks, restauranty like. <laughs> but thank you guys for watching. Um, I really appreciate your support this far. We'll meet in the next video. Bye.